Hey, how's it going? So, welcome back to Dark Souls 2. It's called another first sin, but um, as you may have known, I have Dark Souls 2 on my channel, but it's the original one. I didn't actually know this was coming out. So I'm going to be redoing this, but it's Scholar of the First Sin, as I said already. But it's pretty much the same. I think it's the same story, except for, um, no. The Aldia, which is the new character they added, is in the original. So it's the same story, just different enemies. I think the enemies are smarter and maybe harder. I mean, if they're smarter, they're harder. So I guess that would turn into harder difficulty. But anyway, I'm just going to start new game. I already played through, uh, I got to Drain Lake, and then I realized that I didn't want to continue playing that. I wanted to do record it, because I love Dark Souls, and Dark Souls is my favorite game. So I will be starting a new one, and I'm going to shut up for this cutscene. Hopefully it's not too loud, because I know Bloodborne, the bosses, overtook my voice, and the music was just obnoxious. Hopefully this game does not have the same problem. Because I don't have a legit PS4, uh, headset, I guess you would say. Like, the sound is coming from my TV, not the headphones. But anyway, I already ranted enough. I should start. So, I'm gonna shut up. Saving save data. Perhaps you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. A murky forgotten land. I do apologize if you do hear me drinking something. That would be my diet Pepsi. Just an FYI there. where souls may mend your ailing mind. You will lose everything once branded. The symbol of the curse. An augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. None will have meaning, and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. The spider always me out. A thing that feeds on souls, a hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. Flame. 
your wings will burn in anguish. Time after time. For that is your fate. The fate of the cursed. That's pretty much it to that cutscene, I, if I remember right. Also, I do apologize once again if you hear the volume going up and down, if it actually stays down and up. If it goes on the recording, if so, it's uh, me going up and down on the TV volume because, like I said, it's coming through the TV and if it's kind of wonky, I do apologize. Because some sections maybe might be lower and then some higher. I know for a fact that bosses might be higher than normal because, you know, bosses have epic music and loud music and stuff like that. Look for my Bloodborne series and you will see a perfect example for that. But I'll try something. I'll try lowering the in-game volume maybe just a little bit. Alright. And also, I believe, um, this game is 60 FPS now with the Scholar of the First Sin Edition. Because I know the other one was not. So let's just go into our game options right now. I know... Vibration... Camera sensitivity kinda needs to be a little bit up. Music volume, this is what I want. Voice kinda needs up. Sound effects, down. And that, down. Yeah, I think that's good. Uh, is there any subtitles? No. No, come on. Um. Oh yeah, subtitles are on. Okay, so I already know where to go and stuff. Because this is just like the Dark Souls. The original Dark Souls. It's nothing new for me here except for it looks gorgeous and I'm a big Dark Souls fanboy. You know what game I'm dying to record? Dark Souls 1, but there's like a known issue for the PC version. It just doesn't run, and I can't really run run it that well myself without uh, not recording it. So I'm just gonna go off to here and get our item. Smooth and Silky Stone. That will be used for later. I it's the stupid crows. I don't remember their name. But all they want is stupid silky stones and petrified dragon bones. No, 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 no. <laughs> petrified dragon eggs. What or seems something. to be the ruckus? Stone egg? Can't remember oh the name. My, Damn it. Your face. The face of the curse. It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> You're finished. Oh, man, You'll go hollow. Up. Yes. You'll become one of them. Hollows prey upon men, feast upon their souls. This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> also, I didn't check if my microphone was on or not. Like, I didn't do... Usually I do a what setup, like name? I test how loud the microphone, if it's on, the volume's okay. I didn't do any of that because I haven't actually recorded anything for a week or two weeks. So I'm a bit rusty. I didn't time myself. I forgot to do that. I'm trying to get into the habit again. And okay, what is my name? Um, stupid L2. Stupid Co. Conat. That is exactly my name, Conat. Also, I'll. Yes, I'm done. I'll tell uh, what I want to do in this playthrough a little bit more <laughs> after this. You know oh, with the old ladies talk, name. make fun of me a little bit more. Here's your reward for sharing. 
A human effigy. It's a human effigy. Take a closer look. She sounds kind of evil when Who she says that, that line right there. Who do you think it's supposed to be? Think back. Deep into your past. Yes. It's an effigy of you. I gotta type up. What is an effigy? Like, what exactly is that? So, already know what I want. I want to be a warrior. This is basically going to be the same thing from last game. Except for last time, in my original Dark Souls 2, I did do, um... Look, I want petrified something. Life ring. I want the petrified something because that's always useful. And um, what did I do last time? Uh, oh yeah, I went the hovel armor with the Uchi katana. Basically, that's exactly what I'm just gonna do in this playthrough. The same, same stuff except for no pyromancy. I don't. I like that. Like I like the pyromancy, but. I don't know. Kind of took too much, um, stupid entunement. Or whatever it's called. Yes, this is my true self. All people come here for the same reason. <laughs> to break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Hmm. Doesn't stand a chance. Well, you never know. <laughs> Shouldn't they be giving me hope instead of for breaking down my hope? Go through the door and trot along to the kingdom. Well, at least that's some useful advice right there. Hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going hollow. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. <laughs> I wonder how many times I will die in this playthrough. I'm just gonna guess about 30 to 20. 20 to 30. I got my, my hopes high for this. Alright, so basically I'm just gonna go the Uji Katana route with Hovel's armor and the Hovel shield. That's usually what I usually run, just because, I don't know. I like the Katana in this game, I don't know which is the best Katana. Also, I want Sir Lone's sword. That's another Katana that I do want. Let's break this. But, last time I did do some, um, what's it called? experimenting I guess you would say with pyromancy that was my first time using it and then I did the lightning enchantment on the uchi katana didn't really like that actually so I won't be doing no enchant enchanting and stuff all right this is basically tutorial land semi tutorial just I I don't think I'm we're gonna need our shield I think we can just kind of two-wield right now. I'm confident in my abilities to not get hit. Now I said that, I'm gonna get hit. Watch this. Okay. Two shots. Two shots. Isn't this the part where you backstab someone? Yeah. Right there. Alright. Making progress. Which is always nice. A dagger. Aw, oh, did I get hit? That guy sniped me, like, barely. He barely clipped me. P.S. Wait, what? What? This guy is alive? Sir, I said no damage run. Well, tutorial damage run. Okay. I will. All right, and that guy's going to snipe you. No, no, stop. Just waiting for him to stupid or not. Don't attack me. You're ne 